Hey guys, thanks for dropping by Designed by Kathy. Uh, today, as promised, I'm gonna do a project with using the Color Shift paint. I'm gonna show you a really, really simple, simple, easy project that to do just if you're a beginner, uh, just if you wanna do it. It's also a great project to do like over the holidays uh, to do with a group of people or something. So let's get set up and get started. Okay, I have, um, I'm gonna use three colors of paint. I'm gonna use this, uh, this is a metallic silver, which I think is really pretty. I needed a lighter color in with these two colors I've chosen and I didn't wanna go with just white. So I've got this metallic silver. I have, this is called, I already forgot, Black Flash and it is a color shift paint. And then I have this, it's tropical glitter paint. And glitter, you say, why? I say, why not? Let's do some, see how that works. I am gonna be using my Liquitex Professional Pouring Medium with this, these paints. And I've mixed them about a one-to-one -one ratio with the exception of the silver. It's just, uh, it was a heavier, thicker, thicker paint, so I did add a little more so I could be sure and get some flow, good flow on that. And what, what I do wanna do is layer these, and I will start with my silver. And again, this is such a simple project to do just for yourself, for your first pour, or if you're comfortable with pouring, do it with your family. I did this a while back when I was visiting in Texas, and we had so much fun doing it, so it is a great thing if you got family in over the holidays, get everybody together and just have fun and create something pretty. Whoa, I'm losing my... my stir stick there. Again, as I've mentioned, the only thing I would say to do with this is to, when you're layering your paints in your cup, to bank them off the side a little bit. And that keeps it uh, from just, it just seems to stay on top of the, the layer prior to it a little bit better. Now I haven't used the glitter, the glitter, but it was also, oh, this one's not color shift, it's just glitter. So we have our one color shift in here, the black flash. Okay, so now, <clears throat> when I say this is easy, this is how easy I'm talking about and what you, like I said, do do your first time or do with a group of people. And I'm just going to start, just pick anywhere on your canvas. It doesn't really matter. Uh, pick anywhere. I'm going to just pick up here and I'm just going to start and I'm just going to go back and forth like so. Just, there's no rhyme or reason. You can do any, any, any formation of what you would like because we're gonna flow it, clearly. I'm liking the sparkles. I uh, was a little too conservative on my paint mixing. 
So I've added up just a little bit more here. Uh, how much you mix is is going to be, it's going to, you know, be determined by um, what size canvas you choose to use. And how you pour it on, you know, uh, just pour it on like we did in that first step. Or as you can see, I'm adding a little bit different here just to get a little bit different effect on this end of it. And like I said, this is just something strictly that I just at last minute there decided to do. Um, to me, I like, uh, you know, as I've mentioned in some other videos, I'm really liking having multi-directional um, designs, if you will. But that's not something you have to do uh, do with this in order to to get a cool look. I just, since I had to get my paint, if you keep manipulating it, I don't want to lose, I'm running out of room here, I don't want to lose all of this little section here that we got in it, so You'll want to keep moving it. You don't want to keep it in one steady direction the entire time. But I'm trying to get it, as you can see, I want it to cover the entire canvas, get down and flow off of the edges. Let's see if we can't just kind of help that a little bit. See if we've got anything left in that cup to let it drain out while I work on some of these little edges here. Now what I'm seeing is with the color shift, it's taken on a lot of a blue, bluish tint. Um, and I don't, you know, other than the little bit of glitter, that's the only blue that we have in here. I don't have any other blue, but it's really picked up a blue, which is really cool looking. As I try to dabble and fix these spots, I want to let the paint run back over it so it won't look like, you know, my fingerprint there. I want to kind of, <laughs> my gloves are, okay. I had some gloves there for a while that were super tight fitting. They are really hard to get on and off. These say they're small, but once they get paint on them, they're kind of all over the place. I think that's pretty cool there. It's really taken on bluish and a grayish color, and I, 
I really, I, I probably, you know, the glitter, okay, you can use the glitter or not, but I say, why not? Let's, you know, I got the paint, I wanted to play with it, so why not play with it? Well, I think that looks pretty cool. Hmm. It's interesting. It's got an interesting look. It has some depth to it with, uh, and like I said, the color shift is pretty interesting. You really don't see any black that much, just maybe a little through here, but it pretty much took on the colors of its surrounding, surroundings, which is pretty cool looking. And, you know, the glitter, that's up to you. Uh, I wanted some glitter, just like I said about the paint, thought it looked cool, wanted to try it. So anyway, have fun over the holidays and, and pour something for yourself or with your friends. Hey guys, thanks for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope you'll give it a try. It's very, very easy and it is a lot of fun. So I hope you'll give it a, a try, like I said, with your friends, your family, or for just yourself. But, uh, but, but give it a try and I hope that you'll uh, tag me on Instagram. I'd love to see what you come up with and I look forward to your questions and comments. And thank you guys so much for sharing and for your subscriptions. And if you're new, hey, I hope you'll subscribe and encourage your friends to subscribe. Whatever you do, guys, make it yours, make it personal, and you can do it. Have a great day.